So I think one of the obvious questions is, is um, you know, if a digital waveform you know, looks like this over time, when is it a one? When is it a zero? When is when is each one of these things start and stop? So I mean, this could be a one right, one right here. Then it could be a zero right there, or it could be one and then another one, followed by two zeros. You understand what I'm saying? It could be one, zero, one, one, zero, zero. So how you define this is you use a clock. What the clock is basically, it doesn't carry any information, but what it does. It says it's got its own period that does the timing of the circuit. And any time that this thing goes here, that means, follow that up, that's a bit time. And it says, okay, now one bit has come through. So it's gonna say, this is a one up here. And now this is the second bit time. Is zero. Okay, so basically, clock is a periodic waveform. Very important periodic waveform. Now, basically, it defines the interval. signal A and it's compared to the clock time. So if we imagine, again these are right there. The clock is dividing up bit times and so at bit time 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, A is a 1, a 0, a 1, So that's pretty easy there. Now what would happen if we halved the clock time um, or doubled the clock time? So you have to, so anytime you change the clock time, you can actually change what information you're getting across here, okay? So uh, a timing diagram is exactly this. This is basically a timing diagram. Um, basically, it's showing the relationship ship of signals at various times. Because you can have a bunch of signals here. Now you've got a signal, say, B down here, where B starts off at a zero and it goes up to one, and it's a zero. It's a one and a one and two zeros, opposite of, of A. You can kind of draw that down. If you could think of this here as just kind of basically um, multi instrument sheet music, this is, um, you know, just think here, it's like a samba. Again, all my examples are percussion, so if you're looking for something different, too bad. Okay, pseudo primera, segunda, tercera, low beats, high beats, high beats, low beats, low beat syncopation. High beat syncopation. So basically, this is player one, player two, player three. And that's how you get the uh, samba beat right there. That's the, that's the portion of that. So uh, you know, just think of a timing diagram. 
is similar to sheet music. Oh, I forgot. Uh, quick question here. Um, at bit time uh, 5, what is signal A and signal B? This is the point of a timing diagram. Uh, bit time 5. Bit time 5. What is A? What is B? So we just find 5. We go up. A looks to be 0. B looks to be 1. That's how you use timing.